guys, it's me, Jacob. Welcome back into a brand new video. I have Phoebe here today, and we're going to do the How Posh is Jacob quiz with Phoebe. And we're going to have a lot of fun, so let's get into the video. So the first question is, where did you grow up? Now, we both uh, grew up in the same place, kind of, we weren't that far. We yeah. both grew up in South London. What type of school did we go to? Academy. We sure did. Both of us have gone to academies uh, for the last kind of seven years, even though you've been to two. Yeah. I've been to the one that's sick of my face. What supermarket do you like to do your shopping in? Waitrose. I like, actually on that whole list, I like, I do look quite like Lidl, sometimes you do get some cheeky bargains, like your W5 glasses wipes. Go and get them if you haven't, because they're amazing. Sainsbury's for some things, like you bought folders today. Yeah, folders, and birthday cards. So things like that, I think Sainsbury's is good, but when it comes to food... Waitrose is good. It is. <laughs> Does your family home have a spare bedroom? Mine personally doesn't. But mine does. Does it have a swimming pool or a tennis court? No. Uh -oh. uh -uh. No. Big X. Let's do a big X. Have you ever worn red trousers? Not as I remember. I have. I had them in my wardrobe and the other day, so I don't know if you saw, uh, was it last week? No, it was the week before last, where I wore that whole eggplant outfit. What is your favourite sport -o? My favourite sport is rugby. So rugby, that's the second box, so rugby. I I saw rugby when I was younger, but I never actually have, I, saying that I did play it technically in Piggy, even though me and my friend and ended up standing on the side watching it and we <laughs> ended up talking about god knows what. I like watching it. Watching it is good. But playing it. Oh. <laughs> what are the three uh, main meals of the day? Breakfast, lunch and dinner. Breakfast, dinner and tea. Breakfast, lunch and tea. Breakfast, lunch and supper. Personally, I would say breakfast, lunch and dinner because that's what I have always said. It's like, I never go, hey, it's tea time now, darling. <laughs> supper time, Jacob. Oh, supper time. Supper time. Oh. Do you have your, uh, do you want some tea? Oh, yeah, I'm a bit hungry. Supper time? Supper. Yeah. Let's go and have some supper now. <laughs> right, uh, what would you like for supper today? Oh, maybe some caviar. Caviar? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Don't get caviar on fish eggs. <laughs> Why would you want to eat fish eggs? <laughs> the first thing I could think of. Fish eggs? Well, we were saying supper and tea. So, so we just... Caviar was fitting in? Yeah. <laughs> Does your family own an AGA? Is this Agar? Is it Aga? Is it Aga? Is it Abelson or Abelson? <laughs> Abelson or Abelson. Do you remember the Abelson bear in Tiger? Yeah, that was a good one. We went in Tiger today. We did. We had a good browns. I don't know what an Agar is. I Aga. Don't I don't know what an Aga. So we did some googling, and an agar is a cooker with many doors. Yeah. So kind of like those Victorian-looking kind of cookers, but I personally don't have one. I don't have one either. So we are agarless. No agar. No agar. <laughs> agar. 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 Do you own any tweed? Like no tweed, the material. Oh. I, I don't think I do. I don't, I don't personally anyway, mum on my but I don't personally. So let's say no. Now this next question is very controversial and it goes very close to home with Phoebe. Yeah. So how would you say grass? Now we're from London. We're from South London. Yeah. So we would personally say Grass. Say grass. So is that with a long A? Yeah. Yeah. Say grass. Yeah, because it's not a grass. 
Whereas yeah. my little brother would go grass. 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 Grassy ass. Yeah. But yeah, we personally would say with a long A. How many cars do your family have? Two. We have one. So let's say two. How many houses do you have? One. You have one. Me too. I just have one house. I don't have a house in Tenerife or down in the park. Uno. Uno. So it says, what is your drink of choice? Well, because we're underage, we don't drink. What do you give the name of the toilet? Toilet. Toilet. I think I do say lavatory if I'm going to school and yeah. I need to ask the teacher. And then I say, because I don't want to be embarrassing, be like, can I go to the toilet? Then I say, can I go, miss? Or sir, can I go to the laboratory? And then, you know, then I just feel a bit better. <laughs> but for the sake of things, toilet. toilet. Do you have a crest? I don't even know what a crest is, so I'm gonna say no. I don't, no. What's, what's <laughs> a crest? Leave a comment in the comments below if you know what a crest is. Isn't it the fact like, your family crest is so you create, like the, like the queen or something, she would have a family crest, different things on like a horse or something. Oh. Yeah. Can you ride a horse? Yeah. You work with horses, don't you? Well, my sister does horse riding, so. She's a pro. Yeah, I can't ride a horse, but we'll say yes. Have you ever been hunting? No. 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 I'm a big anti-animal cruelty person. Animals are lovely. Have you been skiing to the races or to the opera? Well, I went to see West End Live the other day, so that means I have seen opera and... I've been skiing. So We're saying GBK. We are massive GBK fans. Have you ever owned clothes made by Jack uh, Wills, Abercrombie, or Hollister? Wearing Jack Wills. I have a and Jack Hollister. Wearing, there you go. <laughs> I have a Jack Wills uh, t shirt in my cupboard. A few things. Yeah. We don't go uh, decked out in it every day. Or maybe <laughs> so. Us uh, being joined together, we got a percentage of 37% posh. You're slightly posh. You definitely like to treat yourself to some of life's finest, uh, finer things and probably have a comfortable childhood. You probably went to a decent school and you cook your meals, breakfast, lunch and dinner. Having said that, you definitely wouldn't consider yourself properly posh. You don't walk around in red trousers or Abercrombie hoodies and you've definitely never been hunting or owned your own swimming pool. So we're 37% posh. Now, I'm going to leave a link to the quiz in the description below so you can go and do it yourself and comment down below what percentage of being posh you got and since doing uh, this video so at the start it was very uh, rainy we we had to struggle with this amazing umbrella that Phoebe has it's like all rainbows and I love the colours because it's all bright and summery and I think your umbrella has magically made the weather be nice so that is it from us this week and uh, hopefully we'll be able to do a video again as soon as we're getting near to summer, S summer, school's out for summer and uh, so yeah we hope to see you again soon. Thanks for watching this video and have a good day. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs>